In this video, I'm gonna be sharing with you a fantastic keyword tool that enables you to do some keyword research right from the Google search results page. It's available for Chrome and Firefox, and it's totally free. So let's get going. Hello, it's Alex here from WP Eagle. I hope you're all well. Before I start, if you're new to my channel, I would love to have you as a subscriber. Simply click the subscribe button below. It's a red button, it says subscribe on it. Give it a click and then click the bell to be notified when I upload new videos. So this video is part of a playlist of 10 videos that I put together with my friend, Doug Cunnington. The playlist is all around keywords and doing keyword research. So if you haven't started the playlist from the very beginning, I suggest you go back to video one right now and then watch it through in series because it will make a lot more sense if you do it that way. But anyway, this video is all around finding keywords using the fantastic tool Keywords Everywhere. It's free to install. It's available for Chrome and Firefox. And I think I should just get on the computer and show you what it's like. Okay, so the first thing we need to do is install our Keywords Everywhere extension. It's available for both Chrome and Firefox. So if you're using either one of those browsers, you'll be fine. If you're not using either one of those browsers, then you're gonna need to go and install one. They're both free. Um, I like both, they're both really good. So uh, go and install one of these browsers. And once you've done that, head over to keywordseverywhere.com which is this site here that we're looking at, and you'll see two buttons, and you can obviously choose the one that uh, is for your browser. I'm running Google Chrome, so I'm gonna click Install for Chrome. It pops this up, which is the Google Chrome Web Store. I'm gonna click Add to Chrome, then click Add Extension. I'm sure the process is very similar for Firefox uh, users. The next thing we need to do, um, it's installed the extension. We've got this little K up the, uh, the top there now. Uh, I just need to enter my email and then I'm gonna be sent a free API key and it needs the API in order to access the keyword data. So I'm just gonna put my email address in here, which is eagle at wpeagle.com. And then I agree and then I agree. And then email me my API key. So I need to go and check my inbox now. Well, hopefully I should have received an email. So let's do that right now. Okay, so here's the email. All I need to do now is click on this link here. And here is my API key. It's across the top here, or indeed it's it's here. I just need to uh, highlight it, copy it into my clipboard. And then if I come up here to my little uh, K, if I give that a click and go update settings, there's a box at the top for the API key. So I can just paste that in. Some other options here that you can adjust if you need to. The research I'm gonna be doing for this example, um, I wanna do it for the UK, because my site is a UK targeted site. So I'm gonna switch that to UK, um, and then we're all done. Let me just click validate to make sure that's working. Yep, the API key is valid, so we're now good to go. So the site I'm gonna be doing some research for today is this one, it's called beershirts.co.uk. It's an Amazon affiliate site that I created a while back. I've actually got a full tutorial on my channel on how I created this site. Um, I'll put a link to that in the description of this video and in a card too. It's got an e-commerce side to it, so there are products and things, uh, obviously all from Amazon, but it's also got a blog uh, with some content. So uh, let's do some research for the blog and find some keywords that would be useful and be good to use for articles. So let's start typing into Google and what I wanna do is do some research around um, Beer hats. So let's do a search for beer hats. Just gonna start time beer hats. Okay, and we can see that um, keywords everywhere is now working. We've got this extra bit of information. So this is telling us the volume um, per month, which is the main figure that we're gonna be looking for because it's that volume that we're gonna be running through the keyword golden ratio uh, formula. And if you remember what Doug said in the first video, we're looking for keywords with a volume of around 250 a month or less. If you're wondering what to do with keywords with a volume that's higher than 250, for example, this one, which has got 1300 a month, be sure to check out video number six in the playlist, which is one by Doug, where he talks about what you can do with those keywords with the higher volumes. Now, the good thing about keywords everywhere is that you can create a list of your favorite keywords. So if this is one that you wanna consider in the future, you can simply just click this little star 
And then when we come up here on the plugin, we've got my favorite keywords and if we click on that, we can see it's there and it's got you know all the relevant information. So it's great, you can build up a, a nice list of keywords, which you can then copy to your clipboard, uh, export to Excel or a CSV or PDF or even print it out on a bit of paper. So let's have a look at the search results page um, and the other features that we get with keywords everywhere. So this one is a little bit high um, for the keyword golden ratio. Let's scroll down. And now we've got the uh, searches related to uh, beer hats. So this one might be quite a good one. People are looking for beer hats on Amazon. So I'm thinking, you know, you could come up with a article around the best beer hats on Amazon. Beer hats, Amazon, our choice, that kind of thing. So that might be an interesting one. It's only got 40 months, so that would be okay for the keyword gold ratio. So I'll click the little star on that one. Vintage beer hats is another one. I'm not quite sure what people are looking for that one, but you know, it might be worth investigating. Let's do a star on that. Um, beer drinking hat, so that's interesting. Let's let's click on that one and see uh, what we get. So again, that's uh, got a great volume. It's got 90 per month, so that'd be perfect. And I guess people are looking for these sort of uh, things which are all available on Amazon. So I could make a really uh, good article around beer drinking hats and, um, and include all of these products. Again, if we scroll down, we get some ideas uh, for more keywords. So the megaphone drinking hat, that is a product. I've seen that on Amazon before. And we've got the beer drinking hat with straws, which is another one we've, we've just seen. So that's uh, that's basically how Keywords Everywhere works. Um, you get your volume and you can then use the related area to identify other keywords. So all of these would be fine because they're all less than 250. And don't worry, the, the number of searches per month isn't that high. Um, but basically the lower the number, the better chance you've got of actually getting some uh, ranking on that keyword uh, and then you will start getting some traffic. So they're ideal keywords to go for. That brings us to the end of this video. As I mentioned at the start, this video is part of a playlist of 10 videos all around finding keywords and creating content and getting ranked on Google. I'll put the next and previous videos up on the screen now so you can use that to navigate your way through the playlist. If you're not already subscribed, then please click on the eagle up there to subscribe and click the bell to be notified when I upload new videos. There's a link to Doug's channel. Be sure to check that out too. Uh, and until next time, I wish you the best of luck with your affiliate sites. Bye for now.